What is up guys? In today's video, I'm going to show you two ways how you can leverage YouTube to get cheap installs for your app. So most of us indie developers at one point or another have tried to promote our apps or games on YouTube with very little results. The reason why uh, you don't see any traction that way is because what we generally tend to do is, and I've been guilty of this in the past too, is record one to two minutes of uh, gameplay and then upload it onto YouTube and just let it sit and hope for the best. So I'd like to show you two ways that have worked personally for me that I've tried uh, to get uh, more downloads and to increase those conversions from uh, watch time into app installs. And here they are. So the first strategy I find that works well is actually having someone record themselves using your app or playing your game. The reason this works so well is that uh, as human beings, we trust other human beings. Um, simply seeing a gameplay uh, video is not going to uh, establish that rapport and trust needed for someone to convert into a user and download your, your app or your game. So just simply having that uh, greatly increases the conversion rate of someone willing to download your app. And the second part to that is actually, so I want you to think of YouTube as a search engine where people are looking for solutions to their problems. So you also need to, once you have the video of the social proof, someone actually playing uh, your game or using your app and showing that how it improves their lives and how entertaining it is, then you want to proceed to rank that video uh, so that when people are searching for uh, solutions to different problems, your video comes up and they are thus more likely to download that app because it solves a problem for them. What I normally like to do is I go to Fiverr and I simply type in video review and there are quite a few services where people will actually create uh, videos um, play, playing your game or your app and you can simply upload those to YouTube and you can get them for around $25 to $50 per video. So once you actually have the video, it's now time to upload it to YouTube and rank for the keywords that your potential audience is searching for. I have come across a really helpful tool called TubeBuddy, which um, allows you to do exactly that. So we'll jump into my computer. I will show you how to use it. It is a free tool. Um, however, I do have the premium version, which is around $5 a month or something like that, which is really cheap, but you can still do this with the free version. So once you have TubeBuddy installed on your computer, you then will see an icon, a TubeBuddy icon on the top right. You simply want to click on that and then go to the Keyword Explorer. And what this tool does is help you find keywords with high search volume and uh, low competition, so it's easy to rank for. So for example, let's say we have a bubble shooter game we would like to rank for. So we type in bubble shooter, explore. And then at the top here, it's gonna give you an overall score, how likely you would be to actually rank uh, your video for that search term. Uh, so it's giving us a score of poor, 19 out of 100. Um, so as you can see, the, the pin, the needle's right on the red. Um, it's got excellent search volume, means a lot of people are searching for this term, uh, a lot of competition for this too, and optimization strength, which simply means how well uh, the current videos are optimized, optimized to rank for this video. So obviously we won't be going just for bubble shooter. So if you look on the right here, it's giving you some uh, related searches. So if we type in this one, bubble shooter for cash, um, it'll bring up a new score. And while we wait for that to load. So what we want basically, oh, here it's giving us an overall score of excellent, which means that if we go after these keywords right here in our video description, as, as sorry, in our video title as well as description, we will likely uh, have a good chance of ranking for it. So you can see, although the search volume is Okay, it's not the best. Um, there is still some search volume for this and you can see the competition. Uh, there's not a lot of competition for it. And um, if we optimize it right, like I said, if we use this, uh, these keywords in our title and description, 
um, in our video description, then we will have a good chance of ranking for it. So you simply want to uh, follow these uh, steps and then once uh, your video is up, make sure that these keywords are in your title and video description and also the video tags. The second strategy that I found works pretty well is actually if you go and find videos that are already ranked, um, that are in your niche, uh, you simply then want to message the video creators and then pay them some money to put your link uh, for your app in their description. The great thing about this is that you can find videos that have gone viral with the channel um, still actually quite small. So you can negotiate on the price. Um, obviously that channel is not really making a lot of money from that video and you can negotiate the price that way. So I just normally offer them between 20 and $50 just for a week to put my uh, game link in there in the description and just to see how it performs over time. If it does perform well, then we can negotiate for longer terms. Um, however, if you don't see any downloads, then you can just stop the campaign altogether. So there you have it guys, those are some low cost strategies you can try yourselves uh, to try and build momentum for your game or app and get downloads that way. If you found some value in this video, please smash the like button, subscribe if you wanna see more content like this. I will see you on the next one. Stay safe and peace out.